Hi guys, it's Sam and I am going to be doing a video that I'm really excited to do. I'm going to color my hair and when it's a new hair dye, I like to share the experience with you and show you the before and after. And the hair dye that I'm using is the L'Oreal Ferio Power, Power, Power Violet in Violet Fixin. And I was really intrigued by this color. I thought it looked cool and I'm itching to dye my hair another color. I've just been dyeing it black for the past few times I've dyed my hair and I think for the summertime I want something new and I'll I've been holding off on using this and I do have to because my hair is pretty thick even though it's not long my hair is pretty thick and I always end up needing two boxes my hair is color treated I don't use a lot of heat styling products on it so I feel like it's pretty healthy for as many times as I've colored it and I have waited I think it's been about a month uh, since the last time I dyed my hair so I like to wait at least a month and I am on second day hair so that's perfect I like to also dye my hair when it's second day or even third day and I wanted to first share with you the products that come in the box because there's a few things that are different than other hair dyes and oh and I got mine at Walmart which I think is the best place to find hair dye I feel like they have the biggest variety Variety usually are cheaper and you can find you can you can find uh, specific hair colors that you wouldn't find in other stores even though let's say Target carries Garnier Nutri's hair color they don't have the ultra color for you know the ultra color for dark hair hair dye which Garnier Nutri's is probably my favorite but I'm just trying this and I hope that it comes out well either way I will film the experience you get gloves and of course you get the developer and the hair dye, which they call Shimmering Conditioning Color Gel. Uh, something new, two things that are new, well, two, yeah, these two things are new and then something else. This is the Aromatic Shimmer Serum and the Color Booster. Those are quite new. I haven't seen, um, well, I've seen kind of something like this in the Garnier one. And then... You get the conditioner, which is standard, and then this is the shampoo, and it says in the directions to shampoo your hair twice with this product, and I think this has a really, it's probably going to stain really bad, so I'm probably going to have to sleep with a pillow, or you have to make sure your hair is really, I'm going to have to sleep with a pillow, yes, I usually sleep with a pillow, I'm going to have to sleep with a towel over my pillow, or your hair has to be dry. Okay, so I've colored my entire head. Well, actually, my sister did, and I was complaining the entire time. I was such a baby about it, but she did really well. And my whole head is saturated. The dye actually turned color from bright red to this really dark burgundy type of color. And it did get everywhere, but that's okay. I mean, I um, expected that with the red hair dye or purple hair dye. And so I'm going to leave this in for 25 minutes. And then I'm going to use the shampoo twice because that's what it says to do. And then I'm going to use the conditioner, but I'll only use half of it. And I'll also have it for the next few times that I wash my hair because I have I bought two boxes. So I'm not sure when I'll be 
back it might not be right away uh, because you can't really see the true co hair color when your hair is wet and uh, I like to I think I'll it's better to show you guys in a couple days and I will also show you in the Sun because that's I feel like you get a really accurate picture of what your hair looks like okay so I'll see you soon Dun, 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 dun. Hi guys, I am back. It's been a couple of days and yeah, this just did not work out and I was really disappointed too. Let me show you what happened. It just colored my roots. I mean, just everywhere, just my roots. And that's, it was surprising that happened because I actually dyed most of my hair and then I dyed the roots last because I thought something like this might happen because it did happen to me with the Garnier a uh, red color uh, that I used uh, that was a Garnier brand and so I was really careful this time and it still just colored my roots I was gonna show you outside if it came out well but it just looks even worse it just looks like I don't I had a bad hair dye experience and I it's not bad I mean you always wish the best I mean I always wish the best when I use something like this but it just unfortunately this did not work let me just turn around yeah it's basically black so I <laughs> I I think I was a little bit more disappointed because I have actually seen people with black hair use this and get good results so I don't know what I was doing wrong let me know if you use this what your experiences have been if you liked it if you didn't like it and I think the next one because I'm not giving up I think the next one I'm gonna try is the Vidal Sassoon one I'm not sure if I'll go with brown or red or purple uh, but yeah this did not work out for me which really stinks but I'm glad I tried it or else I wouldn't have known and that's about it. I hope you guys are all doing well and I'll talk to you soon.